just finished work and I quickly got myself down here to the mosque which you can see uh, just behind me here. We have an, a lovely sunset, uh, we're just waiting for the light to kick off a little bit. There's a lovely man here next to me called Rafiq and um, and yeah, we're just waiting for the, for the light really. Uh, I've got my camera set up to take uh, three exposures, uh, three bracketed exposures, ISO 200, F11, and two and a half seconds, 1.3 seconds uh, as the base exposure. And I'm gonna do a pano, panoramic. It's going to be maybe five exposures in total. And you can see that the water is moving really nicely on this on this lake here, this uh, this pond. So we should get some really nice looking reflect reflections. So yeah, here we go. I've just got back, uh, I'm just sitting in the basement because I want to finish this video before I go upstairs. As I was leaving the mosque I actually spotted a really nice uh, photo opportunity. So two of the members of staff there uh, were actually just sat on, um, sat on the benches, there's kind of like a, you know, steps going down and there's, they're illuminated with lights along. And there was two ladies there in a traditional dress um, sat there and it just it looked amazing you know we had these uh, straight lines going across and then just the silhouette of these two ladies sitting there talking so I actually just uh, stopped on my way as I, as I was leaving uh, as I was leaving the, the location just stopped to take a quick picture of them and um, and yet it's really nice but I wanted to take the opportunity just to talk about taking people's photographs on the street. I went over and uh, actually here in the UAE, you know, there's quite strict laws about taking people's photographs. Um, so, you know, I went over and I asked them, hey, do you mind if I take a quick picture of you and just kind of explained how it would look? And then I went and took the picture and went over and said, hey, look, this is, uh, this is the picture. And they were really happy. They were like, full. It looked great. And um, and I asked to, if they could take a picture of the back of my camera to show people. Um, and I said, don't worry. Just uh, give me your phone number, and I'll send it to you. Uh, I'll send you the picture later on WhatsApp. And I think it's really important when you're taking pictures of people on the street. Um, and I'm sure that you've all been there you take a picture of somebody and you go and speak to them and you say hey look at this I've just taken this really nice picture of you um, and then you swap phone numbers or you swap email addresses and say yeah I'll send it to you later once I've edited it and you know it's in its final stage and I think so often people don't actually send the picture but I think it's really important that every photographer actually follows through on these promises you know it it helps build trust between the, the community of people going out there with cameras who want to capture people uh, you know going and going around their day-to-day -day life um, I, I think it, it really builds that relationship you know between photographers and the general public so what am I trying to say I'm trying to say if you take a picture of someone and you tell them, I'll send you the picture, make sure you send them the picture. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. I haven't got back to the house yet to look at the image, but I think we got something really nice. If you'd like to see how I edited the image, I will be publishing a video later on this week showing you how I stitched the 15 images together and how I edited them. 
So if you're interested in seeing that, hit the like and subscribe button and the little bell icon, and then you'll get a notification when I upload it. So that's all for today. I really hope you've enjoyed the video and I will hopefully see you soon for another little uh, photography trip. Have a great evening and see you next time.